welcome back to another video a few of my subscribers have asked that uh, even after refilling the cartridge uh, it, this printer shows that uh, the print cartridge is low in toner like this black cartridge is very low so what can you do about it and um, if your printer is not printing uh, there is an option so it will let you print even after your cartridge uh, has fallen below this level press settings then there is the system setup and then supply settings uh, there is this black cartridge and then very low setting you have to press ok then there is this option that lets you continue to print so you can continue or stop printing so by default there is this uh, I guess prompt uh, it will ask you like if you want to print on low cartridge or not this option basically stops printing at all so you don't want to use this I have selected continue so you can press ok uh, yes it, it's selected now and if you print with this uh, it will continue and it won't uh, interrupt you at all now there is this uh, annoyance a slight annoyance for some people like uh, black cartridge is low in toner so this keeps reminding you and there's a little that you can do about it and I can tell you something that can really fix this but I don't think that it is so easily available to fix it you have to pull this cartridge and here you can see this chip stores your data regarding uh, the amount of pages you print and the type of content you print on, on your printer so basically this chip tells your printer that uh, your cartridge is low or not so if this chip is available in your country you can buy it but mm, in my country it is not commonly available and even online it's not easy to find this at the uh, at the cheapest prices so I just leave it on I mean you, you cannot do much about it so if you take this off and then put it back uh, this printer won't be recognizing this cartridge and it's obvious that there if the company has put this chip here there's some purpose and you just cannot take it out so you can find a new chip and change it it's not very tough to remove you can use a screwdriver uh, a very small screwdriver and pry it out most of the times uh, this printer keeps working without it so uh, yes this printer may drop the quality a bit but uh, still it is manageable so if you are not printing something very high in quality then uh, this thing is going to be fine and this won't be bothering you a lot. Even if I print right now this will work. I hope this video has solved your query and please like share and subscribe. And don't forget to ask your questions in the comments below. Thank you.